Now we arrived here in Nove Maestra. This, uh, this morning we started to set up. Maybe another hour to pick the bar out, make sure the coffee machine is working before the riders are coming in. That's now the home for this week. Well, we typically try and ride the course more further away from the event. So obviously today would be our main training down the track. You know, sort of finding all the lines that we'd like to ride on race day and, and getting used to the track. My important race, I would like win and uh, away I'll win, we will see. But uh, a lot of rules and uh, really soft terrain. So we just got the brand new 2012 FSR S-Works Epicen for Jaroslav. Still warm, just came out of the mall. First thing I'm gonna start with is putting the sticker on, the name sticker. Jaroslav, he's the first rider out of the team getting the new 2012 product. It's gonna take me about two and a half hours to get it to the point like he wants it. The measurements, everything has to be the same as he's using. Yeah, I think uh, it is best option for, for this course. I'm really satisfied uh, with this bike. Epic 39er forever. I'm lucky to be here in Novi Mesto for a uh, World Cup to see Jarda Kulhavi because uh, I think he's a big champion. He, he won last week a uh, Europe Championship and I hope today we, I can support him for uh, other, vi other win and uh, for his uh, general win in a uh, World Cup. I just had to do a position adjustment because uh, it looks like I'm gonna race the Epic full suspension this weekend. And I think by Sunday it's just gonna be be riding over routes and um, yeah, I'm thinking I have a good advantage with the full suspension. I said in previous interviews I'm gonna stick to the Stump Chomper Hardtail 29er all the time. But um, yeah, Worlds is so routy and technical. So if I race well here with the uh, Epic 29er, it's definitely gonna be the choice for Worlds. It, uh, the routes are quite slippery some places and you know a lot of riders have been through the uh, course and and some r more routes are coming up but it's it's I think it's even more cool when it's like this because then it's more mountain biking. Still I feel very good on my bike, the 29er again. So I've got some smaller chain rings on because I've been riding 40, 26 so now I'm on 38, 24 which I think it's also the reason why I, why I feel like lighter on the bike, like I have the extra shifting I wanted. Uh, but it's power uphill, so uh, short and steep. Also quite technical some places, you have to focus all the time and if you go too hard, you, we will lose time in the downhill. Len is warming up, uh, women start in uh, maybe 15 minutes. Uh, Len has had an up and down year, but uh, fingers crossed she can end the season strong. On the other hand, the men are all geared up. Uh, Todd won uh, the Leadville 100 yesterday, so he's not here. But Christoph, Bury and Jaroslav are good to go. Uh, Jaroslav, I think he needs to finish 10 points ahead of uh, Nino Shooter. We don't generally look at those things, but I think if he does, he wins the World Cup uh, overall today, which is, uh, in my history, it's specialised since 2006. It's, uh, it's a result we haven't yet achieved. Um, so that would be very special, but we won't uh, count our chickens before they're hatched. I'm pumped, that's my uh, best World Cup finish so far and super fun course, like the soil is amazing, you can just totally roost the entire thing, so. And the fade is amazing out there, it's just rolling so smooth, so, and climbing really well too. Uh, the beginning had one of those days 
I couldn't eat, I couldn't drink, I couldn't sweat. But I think I saved a lot of energy with my full suspension epic towards the end. And that was nice going into the lowest downhills and knowing I can catch up to the next group all the time. Things were going well for the first two or three laps and uh, the guys that I just passed uh, came flying back by me and I couldn't hold on to anyone's wheel. And so the only thing that I can think is that I'm still a bit fatigued and didn't allow myself enough recovery before this race. It was an amazing race uh, with uh, a lot of Czech fans and uh, my friends. Yeah, it was a uh, really hard uh, start lap and the new bike uh, was a uh, little bit stiffer, a little bit lighter. Best bike on the world for the cross country and uh, marathon. Jaroslav has been running the Epic 2.9er um, all season and uh, he's been, it's been hugely successful and obviously to win the World Cup is very special and it's the first ever time a 2.9er full suspension bicycle has won the World Cup overall. We were the first company in 2008 under Christoph Souser to win the World Cup on a full suspension bicycle. The goal is still World Championships in a couple of weeks time and uh, then, then the fun will begin. Best World Cup in ages. What a day. So excited. Great crowd for him to win at home. But now we know that we're going to go to sleep late tonight. <laughs>